There's nothing to like about this one. Philadelphia police say a woman used Facebook to hire a hitman. And what's worse, detectives say someone answered the call. Monday night, Jim's off. I'm Rick Williams. And the big story on Action News tonight is the Internet shocker that has two people behind bars and a father happy to be alive. Action News reporter Chad Padelli spoke to the intended target of the alleged social media murder plot. And he joins us live from Southwest Philadelphia tonight with the story. Chad. Rick, social media allows us to convey our thoughts in a matter of seconds, sometimes in the heat of the moment for much of the world to see. And now a young mother is facing some very serious charges. I was in awe because I thought me and her were, were better than that. Those are the emotions of a young father after his ex-girlfriend and the mother of his one-year-old daughter, London Ely, allegedly solicited to have him murdered. Police say Ely posted this message on her Facebook wall. Quote, I will pay somebody a stack to kill my baby father. And investigators say Timothy Bynum, shown here in a Facebook photo, took up the offer. Clearly, if he would have received the money, we think he may have carried this out. Bynum allegedly told Ely, say no more. What he looked like and where he be at. Need that stack first. I'm going to mop that bull. The intended target, whom we're not identifying, says he learned his ex wanted him dead shortly after it was posted and went to police. Detectives quickly moved in. Served a warrant at Mr. Bynum's home. Inside his home was a 22 caliber handgun, fully loaded which had an obliterated serial number. He had pictures on his Facebook of him with guns, so you never take nothing like that lightly. Bynum now faces attempted murder and conspiracy charges. Ely is charged with solicitation to commit murder, and they face a long time behind bars thanks to social media. If all criminals were this dumb, the job would be easy, wouldn't it? It'd be very easy. We'll be standing here tonight. we would all be with our feet up somewhere. And Rick, police here say people need to be very careful before they post on social media, especially if they're angry. Take a moment to cool down and make sure you mean what you say. I'm live in Southwest Philadelphia, Chad Perdelli, Channel 6 Action News. Rick. All right, Chad, thank you.